Hey, what's up, guys? So, today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a web shooter, okay? Spider web, Spider Man. Okay, anyway, web shooter, here we go. Supplies, hairspray, not suspicious at all. Lighter, wait a minute, that doesn't seem very safe. Tape, scissors, a velcro strap, you could use. Anything that you can get around your hand. You could even probably use a rubber band if you really had to. But if you just have any old watches laying around, you can just take off the velcro strap. An old pen cartridge. Let's get into it. Okay. Step number one. Take your lighter and take it apart. Okay. All you need to take out is the gas tank, okay? Gas tank. Everything else you can throw away or keep or fiddle with. So just get the gas cartridge out. And then, so it will have a black thing that lets you measure give out less or more flame and if you want to get it more than just back and forth like this if you want to get it even higher you can lift it up and bring it back over and then do that all over again and then this is just the trigger so all you have to do is just take out the like filler thing inside that, that it's kind of like a it looks kind of like a little tiny straw that just limits it so you can spray more stuff out of it at the same time because that's meant for gas okay so now you have the empty cartridge and the next step is to put some soap in it so let's go okay so here we are in the kitchen all you need is some dish soap okay if you don't have dish soap you just dish soap that's fine but all you have to do to open it is just move it up and over and then just keep on unscrewing it Make sure not to lose the plastic thing that comes all the way up, okay? So, unscrew it all the way. And once that's done, then you can put the soap in it. Once you've done that for a couple of times, now so it's almost out, okay? You're gonna try and do it all the way, okay? So lift it up again, put it back in the groove, lift it up, put it back in the groove. Once it gets high enough, you can just twist it, and then. This will come off. And make sure the black thing stays on there. So now you just have this empty cartridge. It's entirely empty. Okay? So all you're gonna do is take a little thing of soap, just get a little splotch, make sure it doesn't drip over the side. Okay? And it needs it needs pressure to go in. So that's where you take a straw and you go. Okay, so you don't need to screw it in all the way because you want to leave it pretty open so all the stuff can get out, okay? So now just wash it off, okay? Dry it off. Now you have a cartridge that has a little bit of soap in it. Now we're gonna go throw it up with some hairspray. See you there. Okay, so now you're gonna take this and you're gonna put some hairspray in it, okay? Make sure you have the aerosol hairspray or whatever aerosol it's confusing it's a kind of propellant that's what makes the hairspray flammable not the actual stuff so like aerosol is basically in any like let's see full automatic spray thing um so yeah you take off the cap and then you're left with this little plastic thing okay now you have this you op you push this down pushing this down opens it open this and put that right on there and then, as you can see, it squirted a little bit of liquid right there, okay? Take it off really quickly. Don't try and wiggle it off, because when you take it off quickly, it just sprays a little bit, okay? Shake this up again so it can get farther, okay? Put it on, then open it so it doesn't spray everywhere. Push it down again, see if you can get anything else in. Right now I can't, so I'll just try it a couple times. There we go. The liquid is all the way up to the top. Shake it around so it mixes up with the soap in there. Put the cap back on the hairspray, other cap back on the hairspray. That goes to the side for now. All right, let's test this baby out. There it is, full of hairspray. Let's see what it does to this chair. It's more what it looks like than what, what it does, okay? So I'm like a couple inches away. Oh dang, foam. So that's just really cool because if you put that on your hand like we're going to, it looks super Spider-Man-y, okay?
All right, I'll get you guys a slow mo of that. Okay, so I just refilled this with soap. You really don't need soap. It just helps with the stickiness and foaminess of it because, you know, soap makes bubbles. And if you make bubbles in bubbly substances, it gets really foamy. Um, so I may have put a little bit too much soap in this time, but we'll see. Uh, yeah. So let's reload it. Again, just take off the cap. Take off the little cap. And then put the nozzle in here. All right, so you're gonna wanna get your Velcro strap. Make sure it fits around here snugly. Now you're gonna take your cartridge, okay? And you're going to try and center it on here, okay? Next, you're gonna take a piece of tape and your scissors. That was just like folded over, okay? Pretty good sized piece of tape, like inch and a half by inch and a half. Sorry, I'm using clear tape. Okay? And then just put this in the middle and place that across there. Okay? Now, don't wrap it around, okay? Just have it hanging over the middle, okay? Make sure it's completely centered. Now, you're going to cut the sides. Okay, cut all the sides like that. Not all the way. Whoops, that one came off all the way, that's fine. Okay, like that. So now it looks like this. Okay, and all these are hanging off. Now just wrap down the ones that you cut over here, like that, on all sides. So now you have like sort of wings and it's not hanging over, so it's like that. So we can strap it onto ourselves right now. Make sure you put it face down like this and then wrap this over and put it pretty much as tight as you can, okay? So now it's like this and you can just push the trigger and then it squirts, right? That is kind of annoying to reach because you have to like bring your fingers really far back and if you have a, bit, a smaller velcro strap you're gonna have to put it farther back so it's just easier to have a little bit of length that's what our old pen cartridge is for okay so you're gonna cut off the length you want for for this okay just i'm gonna cut off like that much so that's cut off like that make sure you take off the tip too or you can just cut off the back it doesn't really matter and make sure you try and empty the ink so when emptying the ink, you just take off the cap and you blow through it into like a sink. And then right now, it doesn't fit on this white thing, okay? I need it to fit on there. So what we're going to do is flatten it. So get rid of the rest of this ink that's on here. I know where it is. Okay. So now it's flattened. Okay, so now you're going to slip that onto the white thing. And now you have an extended push button, okay? Now, wipe off any extra soap just to get so it gets out of your way. Make sure this is on snugly so it won't slip off. Okay, so I have it here. You can see. Now, this is way easier to reach. And it shoots pretty well, okay? So, make sure it's shooken up. Oh! And then shoot it. Window. That's really cool. How do you like that, Jeffrey? Awesome. Awesome. Now you can paint it and put more tape on it. Yeah. I'm just, that is just, this is just the base design, okay? So you can do a bunch of other stuff. You can try making your own fluid to see which makes it foamy, or you can even try buying silly string. I'm gonna try that getting like a really small bottle of silly string and then rigging it up like this and then shooting it like that but yeah this is just for a costume it's a cool costume thing let's see what it looks like in a full spider-man costume that i made spray painting it and with this on <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah.
That's so cool. Okay, guys, thank you for watching this video. That was super fun. I hope you like it. I hope you make it. All you need, 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 all you need is an old, huh? all you need is an old lighter, tape, scissors, velcro strap, gas tank from the old lighter, and an old pen cartridge that you flatten. Anyway, I hope you like it and subscribe. Do it! Yeah, you should definitely subscribe. Good idea. I'm glad you think like that. Definitely give it a thumbs up and leave a comment to what I should make next or what I should teach you guys how to make next or if I should do a number two biking video. I don't know if you guys want to see that, but they, they upgraded the course. It's pretty sick. It's like a four foot ramp thing. I can, I'll probably do that. Okay, coming up next is probably going to be parkour. I'll teach you guys how to do a couple parkour moves. Wall run, tic tac. Safety rule. Elementary stuff for parkour. Anyway, see you in the next video, guys. Bye.